I'm going to go over why it is that people would appreciate the figure of Satan. Not that I'm a Satanist in the sense that I am a part of Anton LaVey's movement or any of that stuff, or that I worship Satan, so to speak, but I'm just going to talk about why people do appreciate the concept or the figure of Satan. So to begin with, let's assume that the Bible is more or less correct in what it says, and one of the important things that it says is that immaterial minds can exist, that you can have spirits and ghosts and all these things. Well, if that's true, then the classical arguments for God's existence go through. They, they certainly work. There are no real objections that you can formulate against them if materialism is false. So what that means is that there is a supreme being a perfect being, a perfect mind that caused all of the vastness of the universe to come about. And if that's true, well, what do you have? You have a perfect being that you can compare the things in the Bible to. And if that's the case, what you find is that the God of the Bible, Yahweh, is not a perfect being and is a created thing that is far from perfect. And from there, what you can do is compare Yahweh to Satan Yahweh's adversary, and what you'll find, in fact, is that Satan is a lot better than Yahweh. Satan is a liberating figure, whereas Yahweh is sort of this evil tyrant that really doesn't make sense in terms of being a rational and caring sort of being, and both of these things would be created entities created by this great spirit or this cosmic intelligence. And obviously what you'd want to do in this case is to serve the great spirit or cosmic intelligence and also work with Satan, work with the adversary of evil Yahweh to overthrow his power. So that basically describes why Satanism is a good worldview. And it doesn't mean that everyone has to be in a Satanist in the sense that they call themselves a Satanist because that is just something that brings on a lot of baggage of nonsense and so on and so on, but what the important factor is is that having a satanic outlook basically means that you're opposed to Abrahamism, and that's definitely a good thing to be because the Abrahamic religions are very terrible, really, and the figures in them that go against that terribleness are actually great, and uh, Satan is one of those figures, and that's the reason that whether you're an atheist or a theist or an agnostic, you should appreciate that sort of rebellious kind of figure. So I hope you enjoyed this, and I wish you an excellent, excellent day. Auf Wiedersehen.